One o'clock, let's go! This is our 13th time doing this. In the last nine years, it never gets old. I'm for low, so I don't have anything better to do than organize a snowball fight. So you live in Austin, Texas. I do. You don't get many snowfall snowball fights down no, there. No, we don't. <laughs> no, we don't have much snow at all. I think it's kind of a little bit of a respite for people who have been a little bored and at home recently to have something to get out and do and kind of enjoy that's free and fun. <laughs> Shields up, always. <laughs> no fair. What was it like to not get a paycheck on Friday? It's really hard, especially with rent every month. Well, I didn't go food shopping. I've been living on whatever's in my freezer because um, you have to keep the money down because you have to pay rent and pay all the utilities and everything like that. You can't stop that even though you're not getting paid from the government. We're actually getting free pizza delivered here to the Snowball Fighters. So who's first? Okay. Recently moved here, relocated from the island of Kauai to the Washington DC area. So this is brand new for you. <laughs> this is brand new and I'm loving it. Um, I heard about it on TV from you. Well, we're having a really big, awesome, cool snowball fight. It's very exciting. <laughs> There's big, heavy, wet snow right now. And so that's great for packing uh, and making snowballs. Thank you. What does this kind of break from reality do for you? It's really fun. <laughs> Gives us catharsis on all of the things going on in the government right now that we can't control, but just kind of throw a snowball and have a good time. <laughs>